to share that uh, we assisted a lot of clients and businesses here in the Philippines to move their accounting system to zero. There are a lot of inquiries we received from them, some of which are related to the industry they belong, some of which are related to the features of the accounting system, but there's always one thing in common at the end of our session, how secured is zero? So uh, right now we're going to answer this last question, but before that, let's discuss first the advantages of shifting or using an online accounting system. So last year, we have seen the effects of pandemic. Let's not go farther. Now. Here in the Philippines, a lot of businesses are not able to update their books on time uh, because of the lockdown. They cannot go to office and record transactions, and it has a big impact on the timeliness of the books and the meeting tax deadline. Having an offline system works at their peril, and uh, they decided to move to an uh, online accounting system. Simply taking a photo of their transaction, record it remotely by the accountant, can keep their records up to date. If you are keeping your records stored in your computer, your information are nowhere secure, given how powerful hackers are nowadays. If not because of the hackers, there are chances that your computer will get damaged or stolen. With zero, even if your computer is lost, your data is not, since it's stored in a cloud. Not only that, most small companies or most small businesses can afford to spend their fortunes on security experts, automated backup servers, and uh, disaster recovery systems. So it's good that uh, you will get all of those protections at a low monthly subscription, right? So now, Let's deal with uh, the security features when you are using the system. So when you log into Zero, you are immediately asked for a password. So that's your first level of security. Of course, hackers and malware can be installed in your computer and uh, your password can get compromised. That's why Zero added multi-factor authentication. Zero prompts you to confirm your login using an authenticator app. So similar to uh, what's in our slides right now. So I try to log into Zero with my account and Zero sends me a notification to my phone confirming that it's actually me who's logging in. So once I click that it's me who's logging in, then the Zero will prompt me to my website or the account that I'm going to use. So next is shared logging in account or Sharing your password is a big no-no to security. Imagine, how can you do the audit trail? Or how can you confirm who do the transaction if your account is shared to your colleagues or to your workmates? In Zero, you can set up an unlimited user for a value of one subscription. No need for you to share your access. No? Just invite them to Zero by entering their name and email address. Simple as that. Now, when you are using the system, your question might be, how often is the downtime? According to Zero, they have a record of 99.97% uptime. So they use multiple redundancy technologies for their hardware, network, data center, and infrastructure, right? So as you can see in my slide, uh, the last I encountered is uh, on July 27. So, but they're keeping me, they're, they're keeping the clients up to date with the status of their system. And they also have a link where you can see the progress of their update. Now, if you are going to ask me, uh, when is the last time, uh, before July 27, when is the last time that they have a downtime? In my experience, it was uh, last year. So, you see the time lag between the time difference between their last downtime up to uh, July 27. So that's how uh, serious zero is in terms of keeping their record up time. So another question might be, how long can zero keep my record? Zero will retain your data as long as you keep subscribed to them. So all your information will not go elsewhere. You can simply extract or export your reports at your convenience if you need anything from the system or if you need to move out 
from uh, to another system. So I have this experience wherein one of our clients were already shifted to another accounting system. No? But during the pandemic, uh, they decided to move back to zero. No? So they canceled their subscription last year and uh, today uh, they were able to access everything, all the records they have no? uh, since they get back to their subscription. So that's uh, how zero retains your record. So another common security and uh, issues with anything online is phishing. So just like this one, no? a phishing email looks like it comes from a legitimate source, but fraudulently tries to get you to provide sensitive information like password or credit card details. They can also try to infect your device by getting you to click a link to a malicious website or attachment, right? So as you can see here, uh, there's an email address that's pretending to be zero. You know? They use uh, their uh, name as zero business, but you can see in their email address that there's no anything connected to zero. You know? So if the email is connected to zero, it will appear at zero.com. Uh, also, they use the company logo, they use zero logo to pretend that uh, they are coming from a legitimate source. No? And it also has a button you can uh, where you can click no? and uh, a potential malware can be installed in your computer. All right. So zero has a security notice board listing known phishing emails as your guide. So there is a compilation uh, of phishing emails from zero so that you can track there is a potential for phishing email. Also, Zero takes in-depth defense approach to protecting the system and your data. Multiple layers of security control protect access to and within uh, Zero environment, including firewalls, intrusion protection systems, and uh, network segregation. Zero servers are located within facilities that employ robust security control, monitoring and surveillance, on-site security staff, and regular ongoing security audits. Zero maintains uh, multiple geographically separated data replicas and hosting environments to minimize the risk of data loss and outages. So that's why, uh, that's how Zero were able to uh, maintain their uptime most of the time, if not all of the time, no? because the data uh, that the client has done is not saved only in one server. It was saved in multiple servers, in multiple facilities. That's why if uh, one server is down, uh, you will not experience any downtime on your end. No? Uh, since they are, there are data replicas in other parts of the server or in other locations. Zero also encrypts all data and has disaster recovery and readiness through real-time data replication between their geographically diverse protected facility. So also on a bigger scale, Zero is certified as compliant with ISO IEC, which is globally recognized as the premier information security management system or ISMS standard, uh, certified by Antonium. So Zero has produced a service organization control or SOC2 report which is a result of an independent auditor's examination of Zero's cloud-based accounting system relevant to the trust services criteria for security, availability, and uh, confidentiality, right? So lastly, we know that uh, malicious minds are also improving. That's why Zero is constantly enhancing, uh, delivering new features and uh, performance improvements. Updates are delivered frequently, with the majority of them being delivered without interrupting the service and disrupting users. So, in fact, as you can see here in my slide, there is always a monthly product release or monthly uh, system update. And uh, from from the time that uh, from the start that I am using the zero, I did not experience any downtime from the system uh, for their update. What they do is uh, they give us a notification ahead of time that these are the list of the updates that we are going to do on, an, on a month-on-month -month period. 
So you are already updated on what update you are expecting. So also you can reach them through zero support no? or see related articles or watch their video regarding your inquiry. You can also contact them in the support and the customer relationship personnel will respond to you within their estimated time. So that's the commitment of zero in helping you with your accounting and your system inquiry. Right? So in summary, uh, zero security is a uh, top tier. They invested millions and uh, if I'm not mistaken, this is their biggest investment to keep users' financial uh, information secured, private, and store securely. As of today, with over 2 million subscribers globally, we have no information or we have no news about data breach or security breach. That's how zero, uh, serious zero is in terms of their uh, security. All right? So with that, uh, thank you very much. And I hope this learning brings you confidence in using zero accounting systems.